And they're off and racing for the ever-ready RCTC Gold Vase, a very level break by all seven runners. And as they sort themselves out, Adamaro is going to do the donkey work in front. He's got to run away into a lead of about four and a half, five lengths here from Adrestia in second place. In third, there is no more politics. Just behind him then uh, on the outside, a Crider. Then we've got Shaurisha and along there with uh, Triumphus. They approach the first right-handed turn, and uh, as they go away from us, and it continues to be Adamaro doing the work in front. Now about seven to eight lengths, the good of Adrestia. About a length behind Adrestia comes the stablemate there, and that's Akrida. Moving up on the outside of Akrida is the Western India import, Square Moon. And two and a half away come the stablemates, Shaurisha, Sh and just behind them there, Triumphus. As they go past the 1,200 meter marker and uh, Adamaro's lead being cut down, the pace slowing down slightly too, but Adamaro's pace uh, lead being cut to just about two and a half, three lengths by Adrestia continuing to be in second. In third is a Crider, keeping him company on the outside there, Square Moon. A length and a half behind then we've got uh, no more politics, Shaurisha and Triumphus all bunched up together. They've got a little over 800 to run in the ever-ready RCTC Gold Vase, and Adamaro continues to bowl along just about two lengths now. The good of the bottom-weighted address here. Just behind is a Crider making a forward move then, and making, moving up on the outside is Triumphus. Dropping a bit back there is Square Moon. A length away, no more politics and Shaurisha. They're beginning to negotiate the turn and they're really bunching up with Adamaro being joined on the outside by Adrestia. A crider on the outside and they're forcing Triumphus to come six, seven horses wide. Round the turn now and into the straight. Adamaro still the leader from Adrestia challenging down the middle. On the outside there comes uh, Triumphus with a run. Square Moon is getting his head into it as well. What a finish we have here for this RCTC Gold Vase. And Square Moon has kicked away and flying on the outside is uh, Shaurisha. It's Shaurisha on the outside from the Square Moon. Squ Shaurisha, Square Moon locked together in a tremendous finish. Followed there by Triumphus and then came Adrestia. So an absolute incredible race here in this ever-ready RCTC Gold Vase. The lead changing hands four times in the short span of just about 200 meters before Shaurisha.